that whole title. I feel that we are totally doing that, being the butchies. We're redefining femininity, being on stage. We are women. Yeah, walking into women's bathroom and people fucking scream. I'm not necessarily going out, first and foremost, to define femininity or gender roles. I, I'm lucky enough to have been born me, so I just do that every day. It is really important for people, especially women, to be able to conceive of themselves as, as storytellers and as, as people inventing their own reality. And, and art is not the only way, but it's certainly, um, it's certainly the way for me. How do you feel your work is helping to redefine women's roles? In Indigo Girls, we've made a pretty big effort to hire like women techs, women, women to run sound, and we hopefully are telling people to believe in themselves and show that women don't need to compromise their standards in order to, to be part of the industry. We got 100% creative pearls. Okay. Yep. People just realized that they weren't going to try and tell us what to do. Your eyes on your side, sold the prize. You can't buy. Sweet, 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 sweet,
Because my brother, they used to call him Little Dino, and he used to imitate James Brown really well. And so I would like try to do what he did like, a lot of the times. And so whatever my brothers would do, I always tried to do a little bit better. You know? I'm 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 did your parents ever encourage you to be more feminine? Yeah, my mother's, my mother got a little upset a couple times. Wear a dress. Stop wearing those pants and those sneakers all the time. People talk. What they saying, Mom? <laughs> Chicago. Okay.